Yo, what's good, y'all? What's good? Welcome to the channel and welcome to the last day of Reactober, day 31, y'all. Happy Halloween to everybody that celebrates Halloween. If you don't celebrate it, then happy regular day. <laughs> But hey y'all, uh, I came with a real different video. This is a video that I've been seeing going viral on TikTok lately. And if you're a Disney head like me, a Disney kid like me, an OG Disney kid like me, and you remember like, good luck Charlie, um, you got Bob Duncan, Gabe Duncan, and then a surprise guest, which I do know is Charlie Duncan, okay? Um, I don't know how to say her name. I think it's Mia. I don't want it to be wrong because, you know, M-I-A can literally be Mia, Maya. It's one of those names that, like, you you just don't know until they say it, you know? But, yeah, I'm excited um, to see because they're making some shrimp scampi. I love food recipes. I love to cook and all that. I went to culinary school, so this is right up my alley. And then, plus... I'm getting a little bit of nostalgia vibes because I used to watch this show a lot when I was growing up, you know, when Good Luck Charlie was coming on and all that, with Bridget Medler and all them people, you know. Um, I'm excited, y'all. Y'all already know. I'm going to like this video. Hit that like button, y'all. Hit that like button. Let me know down below who y'all dressing up as tonight. All right, let's get into it. Hi. Hi. Welcome back to... Uh, Welcome back. The show we still have yet to name. So today we are going to be making a shrimp scampi, but Eric, actually, I have a surprise for you. Oh, oh yeah, already surprised. Where did we get it? Oh, okay, yeah, I really guess cool. you know so how to make it. Our first guest uh, sh chef with us. <laughs> so we have somebody cooking with us. This person has been in the bedroom for quite some time while we've been getting ready. Okay. Okay, so this person has uh, four Michelin stars. <laughs> you don't believe me. Well known on television. Mm -hmm. Still very well known. So this is your genuine reaction. You don't know who this person is. No. I just want the camera to know. This is you've never seen this person before. You don't know who's coming out. Okay. 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 You know this person better than the person knows I'm, you. I'm nervous. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be nervous too. I did see that she was 15 years old now. I'm just like, dang man, I'm 20. So. I guess when I first started watching Good Luck Charlie, I don't know how old she was, like, as the baby. Because she looked like a baby. She was a baby. But I don't know. She could have been, like, one years old, two years old. I don't know to, like, like the age that she finished Good Luck Charlie. I don't remember. So, yeah. This person I'm actually scared. barely knows who you are, in fact. Well, that, that's a fairly large category. Okay. But uh, this person also gets uh, referred to as, as somebody in your family. You can come on out now. <laughs> it's your daughter, Mia. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Took him long enough. <laughs> Swear. He looked at her for like five seconds. If, like, I know it's been a long time, probably since they had even seen each other. I don't know. Like, usually cast members don't really, like, stay in touch like that unless you're, like, really, 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 really close. But, of course, you might have them on social media or whatever. I did see on her TikTok that her mom manages her TikTok, so I'm assuming that's for all platforms. So, I mean, that's a little different, but... <laughs> oh, my God! How are you? How are you? How, how can you look like this when you're only four? We were trying to figure out, you genuinely have not seen her in probably 10 years. No, 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 not since the last time I saw you. We have the, with, there's the picture of me and Bradley holding you upside down. Oh, shaking all the change. From here for Lee's Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, shaking, yeah. shaking all the change out of your pocket. Ten years ago. Ten years. This is fantastic. So she, she's taking a cooking class right now. So that's why we're making a uh, shrimp scampi. I'm so happy. I may actually, I may actually tear up here a little bit. Oh. Well, you never give that reaction to this me. This is so happy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Mia. Yeah, all right. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, Mia. Yeah, all right. We're gonna. I'm so happy you're here. So, oh my god! I'm so in insanely. I'm so happy right now. How tall is okay, he? Okay, the uh, surprise out of the way. Uh, this, <laughs> I know, isn't this crazy? I'm a little flustered. Have you noticed my voice is like two octaves? <laughs> You're usually rather flustered, too. Yeah, yeah but this is a good flustered. This isn't like, where do I live flustered. <laughs> I saw you at Bridget's wedding. You haven't seen her 
since No, I missed Bridget's wedding. Yeah, you were filming. Yeah. That sucked because we were all there. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. It was probably better that you weren't there, but <laughs> we just said, we are going to be making shrimp scampi today because... It's my favorite meal. To eat. To eat, apparently. I was under the impression this whole time it was to cook, but <laughs> I guess we're all going to be figuring this thing out today. But I think we just start off with some shopping. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mia, when yes. you think back... On Good Luck Charlie, is there a particular scene, something that jumps to mind? Oh my gosh, I remember I was in my dressing room and I was doing some like. Two years old. <laughs> I was doing some like trick on the couches. I remember I was like yelling at my mom to go get you because I loved really? and I wanted to do the oh, yeah. trick that I was doing. <laughs> when I think of the two of you, it's you oh, throwing her yeah. up in the air and then. Oh, yeah. I would take Mia around the stage and I would toss her up in the air and catch her. Uh, when we're not shooting, they shut out the lights for the stage to save electricity or whatever. But they have these big, dark, black boom mics that hang over the stage to get uh, everybody's dialogue. So I'm walking around and I'm throwing me up and it's, oh, it's all great. And I throw Man, babies love that. Babies love where you just throw them up in the air. Like, they, they be... <laughs> No care in the world. Like, if somebody did that to me now, I'd be scared of shit. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> but, nah. And every time I see them, <laughs> it reminds me of when, <laughs> when he dropped. Which baby did he drop? It, oh, it was like this big slow-mo. He was going down the stairs, and, he, and one of the babies went flying in the air. It might have been Charlie. And he actually caught her. I don't know. That's all I think of now. Head first into one of the boom mics because I didn't see it. I didn't even see the mic. I throw Mia up and I see Mia do this. Ah! <laughs> and then everybody on set also went, oh! <laughs> and I brought her down. You were fine. We were talking about it afterwards, and then you went, yeah, my daddy tosses me up in the air too, but he doesn't bonk me. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it doesn't bonk. Okay, so let's turn this thing on. I was in that scene. It was just you and I in the scene where you threw her up into the boom. It was the funniest thing I've ever seen. My favorite sort of Mia journey is the fact that when the whole thing started, we were swaddling you, and then by the end, we were actually doing full-on scenes with you. Yeah, that's like with I'm, lines and direction. Oh, yeah. And the first episode I directed, you and I had a scene. Oh, you directed together. Yeah, I didn't. I, I, I never approached it? you because there was no. <laughs> there was no fixing that. <laughs> smile, just smile at the camera, buddy. No, but it was great because I remember, like, not only was Mia doing scenes, but Mia would take notes. I don't know if Incredibly I remember correctly, talented kid. I think Mia had a bit of an attitude. I'm assuming that wore off. I'm hoping. <laughs> No, I mean, I don't blame Mia. There was a couple of, especially when we were shooting in Utah, there were some very long days out in the sun, outside, so. It's the tiniest thing all the way. It just looks nice. Is it old. basil time? Yep, you tell yep. us. Yes? So. Yes. Does look good. I don't like tomatoes, though. I'm not even putting just tomatoes wine. In. It's all going to burn off. Don't worry, we're not feeding them right here. <laughs> alcohol. He's gonna feed Whenever you cook alcohol. with wine, always make sure you double. I forgot to tell you, your father's an alcoholic. You double the recipe. I know you haven't been around in a while. <laughs> the dad's been going through some trouble. I hit it. I hit it. How do you get on a show as a baby? What was the audition um, process like at eight months old? I remember, like, from stories that my mom has told me. She got me an agent. I think I had, like, one audition before Good Luck Charlie, and then I auditioned for Good Luck Charlie. Go in the audition room. They kind of just see how, like, easy you are. Like, easy to work with, I guess, and, like, calm. Normally, they'll get twins, so it'll go faster, but they love Mia so much that they uh, they just went with her. Now we're putting some chicken stock in, just in case anybody cares about the food that we're cooking. Because <laughs> she was a baby baby. Like, if I remember correctly, when, I, when Good Luck Charlie first came out, like, she was supposed to be like just born type thing, so she was really, really small. But like she said, for the audition process, I guess it, it was just more so like which baby can be worked with the easiest with. Like, like she does. Like she seems like a very quiet girl right now. So I could imagine like when she was younger and even in the show, I feel like she was very quiet <laughs> for the most part. Like, so I, I can see why they chose her to, to star in Good Luck Charlie. We want some capers in there. Yeah? So. 
Let's get a little pepper. In. Sure. My other favorite Mia moment was we were in uh, Utah. We were down in the restaurant, and you said, I would just like to thank all of you for doing my show. <laughs> it was so sincere and so sweet and like nothing on it. You want to cook the shrimp and the sauce could be nice. Yeah, why not? You have a posse now. You have a posse of friends. You, was, do you own that school? That's what I was going to ask you. You own that school like, now? Do you get recognized? I, I was sitting outside during my fourth period and some guy like came up to me and he like dabbed me up. He's like, oh my God, oh my God, if you need anything, just call me, call me up. Like I loved watching you when I was a kid. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're in with the mom now or something? Realistic. Period. So do you get recognized for those other things and the people know you as like the baby from that show? Well, I feel like, uh... Oh my god. Whoa. You, first off, you missed and it's on the burner right now. That's cooking, my friend. That's called cooking. Stop shoving That's out. called cooking. <laughs> uh, you know, this is the guy that what a tip? Like, the like, dressing room to watch a joke on the couch. You never know? mind. Generally on this show, Eric does a good portion of the cooking. I'll do the plating because no, he certainly does the eating. But I'm gonna let you do the plating. Put a little of the parmesan in there. You can grate the parmesan in there. You want to grate the parmesan? Just let it melt a little grate, bit. Grate the parmesan. Don't let him boss you around like that. Let me do this. Yeah. Help you out a little bit. Be good, do you think? And then we'll put some on fresh. Yeah. What are you supposed to do? Throw it at the wall, and if it sticks, it's good. Is this thing on? Awesome? Or all right, pasta's ready. You're supposed to save pasta water, aren't you? Okay. Do we want to put it in there and let it cook for a minute? You want to put it on a plate and then pour it? Ah, chef! Yeah. Usually, what do you want to do? Usually we mix it. Water. No kidding. Chef gave it. Chef gave it the approval. I Chef's like my kids. noodles like. That looks pretty. Here, you know. I like my noodles still a little bit hard. Not hard, <laughs> but is it al dente? Al dente? A L D E N T E, Al Dante. I think. Don't. Never mind. <laughs> you can almost do it with like chopsticks. Oh, look at this! Come on. Oh, it didn't stay together. No, that's nice though. That's good. Well, to your standards, anything. <laughs> Let's do another roll, I think. Okay. This is all. Don't listen to me. Hey, Missy, good with the sauce and everything. I think it's sweet. Yeah, you got it. You don't have any chopsticks. Yeah, you don't have to use the chopsticks. Just hold like that, yeah, no, and just keep it tight. Keep it tight. But You're doing this right. <sighs> What's going on over here? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, man. That'll work, though. Okay. Put, like, one on top, and then... And then, like, one here, here, and here, you know? Like, here? Yeah. Right here. It looked good. It was, like, I need some more sauce. I need some more sauce. Well, before. I chose it because they put me in theater, and I didn't want to do theater. I don't like being on like the stage where I can't redo things. I, I feel that. Oh. I agree. Do you still like acting? Is, it, yeah. is acting still fun to you? Yeah, I still like it. I enjoy it. Mm. Eric, will you take some? Okay, of this? that's what I was wondering. Oh, she still wanted to act. <laughs> yeah. I think we we need to sell a TV show that it's about you watching all the video diaries. She starts making the video oh. diaries. Oh yeah, we do have another child. Yeah, there is another <laughs> child. I forgot child. about that. Yeah, or that's the HBO version. Is now it's your child. <laughs> <laughs> then, then it's really called Oops. Yeah. <laughs> Looks nice. Oh wait, <laughs> hang on. Ah. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Yo, he acts Looks the nice. most like his Looks character. Right. Out of these three, well, <laughs> it might be a tie, but for the most part, Eric, I think it's his name, Eric, who, who's Bob Duncan, he actually <laughs> acts pretty similar to his character. This is what it looks like. Here we go. Shrimp scampi. That looks Parmesan, really good. Chives, chili flakes and stuff. <laughs> if this somehow inspires you to make it. Let us uh, know. Send, let us know. Send us a picture. Another success. Um, I have. To, <laughs> I'm sorry. Did I move your lemon? You absolutely made my day today. Just, just it's just so day. great to see you again. Thanks for the damn. I hear the alcohol in the bag. Lessen up the joint. So thank you for having me. Yeah, of course. Yes. Anytime please, you're welcome here. Anytime. Please come back because I need a buffer between me. And you. <laughs> Mm-hmm.
<laughs> oh yeah, they said they was gonna recreate that photo. <laughs> That's cute. That was so cute. <laughs> All right, y'all. So that was Eric Bradley and Mia making shrimp scampi together. That was so cute. Oh my gosh, it just. I think somebody said it on the TikTok that I seen. They said um. They're, all, they're gonna think of this as like a continuation of Good Luck Charlie. <laughs> it was just so funny. I was like, yeah, definitely brought back the nostalgia vibes. Hope y'all had some nostalgia vibes as well. Thank y'all so much for watching. Stay tuned and stay litty. Yeah.